Yeah, here. Hey everybody. Uh, I am. You gotta wear these. I have to wear these. Okay. All the time or? Yeah. Oh, okay. Even when I'm not shooting? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's even. That's even more fun. Than okay. Like, okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> Wow. Hey everybody, uh, I am coming to you from Capital City Clays in Austin, Texas. And when in Texas, you, uh, you do what, wow, that's like there's something on there. I can't even see out of that. Uh, you do what Texans do. And uh, of course, the first thing that we did when I got here, uh, good morning, Daryl. <laughs> I am not mad at Clay. <laughs> good morning, Beth. I thought this might be interesting and also, uh, this is something that Walker had planned to do with a, a friend of his named Ray. Hey, Ray, come say hi. This is Ray. This is Ray. And uh, what's your last name, Ray? Palmer. Palmer. Ray Palmer is a friend yeah. of Walker's from... Uh, I'm from Connecticut. From Con yeah. Oh, yeah, but well, I mean, how do I know him? Yeah, we played on a volleyball team. Before. Oh, that's right. They play on volleyball. Yeah. Uh, that's uh, beach volleyball. Yeah. And they played at a, at a tournament playing beach volleyball the other night. And it was, what, what was it, 30-something degrees? It was cold. Very They're cool. playing barefoot in sand in 30 degree weather. <laughs> it was ridiculous. It was. And you didn't win. No, we didn't. But, but we, we, we did well. You we did, did well. Really well. Cool Here's game. Walker over here. Everybody say hi. You know you know my bud. How you guys doing? My guy. <laughs> so uh, they're getting all ready for the uh, to do to shoot clays. I guess uh, I guess we're mad at clays. And Walker bought this. Actually, he didn't buy these for me. He bought them for his girlfriend. But I get to use them today. And who's writing? Let's see. Gosh, I can't even see this. Uh, Mix, hi from uh, Latvia. Oh uh, wow, I can't see with those things. Oh, it went away. Okay, you'll have to you'll have to say hi again because I missed it. Uh, we're gonna walk down to this thing now. I have uh, never uh, done this before, and I'm gonna give it a try because I'm a good sport. Hey, Jack. Oh, Jack, well, you have to stay for at least a few minutes. Yeah? Oh, a few minutes because um, uh, you want to see me try to shoot it. You know I'm not going to hit it. I mean, how could I possibly hit it? I've never tried it before. And, uh, you know, I don't have the eyesight of uh, these guys. So let me get in front of you so you can see them walking with their shotguns. We went uh, to buy ammunition last night. And uh, let's see. Oh gosh, I wish I could see this better, but it's foggy and um, Foxfire, I, I can't, I'm sorry, I couldn't see that. You'll have to say hi over and over everybody if you want my attention because, uh, oh goodness, let's see. Teresa, food for us, that's Rebecca, Benjamin. Good morning from somewhere, uh, Benjamin. Uh, Benjamin, write me again, because I missed that. Benjamin uh, is my, oh, my shoe is untied. Benjamin is my father's name, you know. Uh, let's see. Hi, Kate. I just wanted to mention, guys, you know, Kate, who has been our moderator. She's also a moderator for Daddy Curbs, if you follow Daddy Curbs. Hi, Amal. <laughs> I got to meet Kate yesterday. My son is finally teaching me how to shoot. Fantastic, Teresa. You and I have something in common. Uh, about 10 years ago. No, I wasn't 10. Wait, was it 10? Yeah, it was about 10 years ago. No, it was more than that. It's probably 15 years ago. I think it was, wait, no, whatever. Uh, my brother took us to a shooting range in Virginia and we shot handgun and uh, I did okay. You know, I have, I have vision that I have to correct my vision. Hi, somebody, I, I missed it. Um, and uh, if you have really great eyesight, of course, you're going to be much better at shooting. Uh, yes, uh, I am a California girl. And, and as you can see, Walker, I said, Walker, are you, are you really wearing shorts today? It was 32 when I got up and it was 41 about, you know, 30 minutes ago. And um, I said, I'm not going to suffer. I'm cold. Uh, let's see. <laughs> it's chilly. It really is chilly. Anyway, I, guys, I got to meet Kate from inside Kate's kitchen yesterday. She drove up from the countryside about 50 minute drive or something uh, to meet me. And uh, Rebecca, uh, her dad's a Marine. Are you from Tennessee? I am, but I didn't get that whole comment. I am from Tennessee. 
and I I wanted to say everybody well you know I'm just walking along and all these people are shooting all around me but I am going to trust that everybody is shooting responsibly and that I don't get shot um, yeah so anyway I was saying Kate drove up yesterday oh, gosh oh my gosh Kate used to shoot competitive and among, among other many other things Kate Kate is an amazing person we had a great day we she took me to eat uh, at an original Austin restaurant it's 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 called catfish parlor and uh, you know I'm from Tennessee and we uh, we grew up eating catfish uh, here and there a great catfish dinner hush puppies coleslaw oh my gosh and I had black eyed peas and I had banana pudding now you know I I had the best banana pudding growing up so I can't sorry I should probably be quiet um, this is not hunting animals where you have to be really quiet, but I guess the, I guess I'm supposed to probably be quiet. Um, anyway, Kate and I had a great time and she has had an amazing history and she has, she comes from an, an amazing, uh, wow, people are just shooting all over the place. Um, hang on, let me turn this around. Oh, here we go. So you can see what's going on just following my guys to our spot hope you can hear me hope you can hear me okay Daryl Kay I can't walk and read and talk at the same time I'm not capable um, let's see okay have you have you got the right place have you got the right place? Huh? Have you got the right place? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, so. Um, you should put these on, Mom. Now? Okay. Okay. Hang on. Good morning, Denise. You are missing all the action. You did miss. No, you haven't missed the action. I'm going to try to shoot. Not yet. I am trying to uh, balance. Hold. Hold this. Let's see. Let me see if I can do this. Okay, I am going to put my these on. Oops. Oh, gosh, I hope I can. I hope I can hear you. Hi. Uh, uh, my shoes untied. Okay, guys, I just wanted to uh, go ahead and have a live stream, even though we were doing this today, because that's what they were doing, and I didn't want to, uh, I didn't want to be a party pooper and say, no, I've got to stay home and do a live stream. No, no, I'm not going to do that. So, <sighs> anyway, oops. I am going to just talk about this really briefly while they're getting set up and shooting and I want if you didn't see my post on on my community page oh gosh I can't read that Putin up Thailand hi uh, download Rebecca you got this right uh, download my new calendars you can get it into black and white and color and uh, that's January and this is a free download on my website I'm going to tell you what the link is and you're gonna write it down and then I'll also when this is finished I will put it underneath the video but it's latebloomershow.com forward slash ca uh, calendar dash planner forward slash calendar dash planner and this is January and if you like to doodle and a lot of people do uh, each month trying to blow away each month 
there will be a black and white version that I have taken these images. I mean, I know. These, this is an actual came camellia from my garden. And I went back and got photographs over, I looked at January and I said, what is the most beautiful photograph I have from January? And I looked from 2012 to 2015 images. And I selected this one because it, it, it needed to be an image that can be, uh, uh, how do I say this? Uh, removed from the background easily and stand alone as a standalone image. So this is a camellia. This work has all been done by uh, Celine under my direction. Uh, Celine is my graphic arts helper. Uh, when do you plant canna lily? You know, canna lilies just come up. Does anybody know when you plant canna lilies? Because they just come up in my yard. I've never had to actually plant one. But anyway, back to the calendar. Uh, thank you, everybody. Uh, hit that like. You can go uh, and doodle this, color this in yourself. Each one of these images I have turned into a black and white image. And here's February. This is one of the first cauliflowers I ever grew. And this is what it looks like. Uh, almost, yeah, wait, uh, give me two minutes. Uh, that's the black and white. And uh, here's March. March is nasturtium. And here's the black and white version. And Celine has designed each month with different graphics, with different uh, fonts. Uh, you'll notice the fonts are different on every month. And she picked fonts that she thought um, Wait, is that today, Daryl? Today is the shortest month, isn't it? The 22nd? Today is the 22nd. And here's April, everybody. So you can go to my website. Isn't that a beautiful red cabbage? That's one of the first red cabbages I ever grew. Good morning, Mr. Tom. I'm talking about my new calendar planner, which you can, uh, I want you to download this. Make a note right now, if you haven't already gotten this. Uh, that is latebloomershow.com forward slash calendar dash planner. And uh, I want you to put on the calendar when, when we have, when, when I have my next live stream, we're going to sit down and we're going to plan 2020 together. But go ahead and download this and get this. And please put on there, I made two plans already. I want you to uh, make notes of where I'm going to be. And I'm going to be in Nashville. Uh, I'm going to be in Nashville the 24th to the 29th of January and I'm going to go to Phoenix. We just made this plan yesterday. I'm going to Phoenix on March 6th to the 9th. Okay, now I'm going to turn this thing around and Ray, oh, uh, let's see. Uh, hmm. Ray or Walker is going to, actually, you can just kind of do it like that. Okay. I'm not sure. She's going to shoot now. <laughs> okay, somebody's going to teach me what to, how to do this. Okay, wish me luck, everybody.
we're thinking too much, but you don't want to shoot like the second it comes up. You want to give it a second to, to kind of you want to give down. your second uh, yourself a second to get to it, but don't yeah. wait too long. Okay. You want to within like within like two seconds. You probably want to okay. So you want to wait till you can up? You can if you want. Yeah. You don't. Uh, but yeah. It, it seems like it slows down. It does, but it gets further away too. It's pretty heavy. I mean, <laughs> it's it's the light. Let's load this thing and let me shoot it. So to load it, you pull forward on that. Yeah, you gotta pull hard. Yeah. So then, all right, safety's off. Yeah. Wait, what? Is it ready to fire? It is ready. Okay, are we are we moving? Oh. Okay, that thing is just too heavy. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm sorry guys. Uh Okay, how many does she kill? Yeah, I killed it. I I killed at least one branch off of a tree. No. The second one I actually shot in the air. But um I am not used to having a heavy gun like that, and there's no point in trying to get it again right away. I should have just shot it once and taken a break because it was getting heavier and heavier, and uh, I knew I couldn't manage it, so that was not good. Hey, uh, Christine, I couldn't see that. Uh, I'm gonna sit over here and watch and set the seat sweat so I can't sit. Um, I'm going to show you these guys. Thank you, Brian. <laughs> hey, I, um, you know, that's, um, you know, you, you need practice doing that. And I have never done that in my life. So now I did shoot, a, I think I shot a rifle once, my brother-in-law, but, but the rifle was sitting on something. I wasn't having to hold the weight of it. And, um, uh, Mm, you know, that's my broken arm. And I just, uh, remember I, I, I broke this uh, uh, arm, uh, let's see, it would be two years ago, two years, two years ago and two days, it was Christmas Eve of 17, uh, this arm was broken right here. And that's the first time I've held anything heavy like that, tried to balance it. And after I shot it the first time, I thought, wow, that's just, I'm not going to be able to hang on to that. And um, thank you, Anna. <laughs> I do want to to uh, get better, but I realized uh, that the strength of that arm is, um, is not where it should be to, to do this sort of thing. So anyway, uh, I... Uh, I hope you'll get the planners and I hope we can plan 
uh, January together and uh, I want to know what you're planting and 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 what your plans are if you're traveling and of course if anyone is going to be in Nashville uh, at, the, at the end of January that would be awesome maybe we can hook up um, people are talking about planting and I'm glad I'm glad you're talking amongst yourselves I'm gonna give you something to look at while you're doing that Has anybody hit one yet? Oh, you did? Oh, shoot, I missed it. I hit one on the first station. Oh, I'm sorry, I missed it. Good morning, somebody. I, I missed it. Uh, write me again. I, uh, hey, Christine, uh, Christy, I mean, um, See, my problem was once I did it the first time, I just, uh, my arm felt weak and I couldn't uh, keep holding the gun. So maybe skeet shooting is not going to be my thing. I mean, I call this skeet shooting. They call it. Oh, wow. That, that's coming from a weird place. Where is that? From over here? I've never claimed I'm good at this. I <laughs> Is this one coming from over here, Walker? Is that one coming from over here? Oh, okay. <laughs> wow, very nice. How long have you been doing? Hey Ray, how long have you been doing this? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What do you hunt? I'm sorry. What do you hunt? Waterfowl, birds, ducks, geese, pheasant, those kind of things. Is that what you would hunt around here? Yeah, I just started. Oh, okay. I've only been here for three months. Oh, from where? Oh, you said Connecticut. Right, right. Uh, yes, Christina. He planned his uh, outing today at 10 o'clock, and I said, I have to do a, a live stream. So I thought, well, I would just give it a try. Obviously, if you tuned in in the beginning, you saw that I did try it. And I still feel that, even though I just did it twice. I still feel it in my shoulder. And I did, you know what? I didn't even think about my broken shoulder when I thought about doing that. Isn't that funny? Never even occurred to me. But uh, boy, I, uh, <laughs> I'm reminded of it now. Uh, I mean, it doesn't hurt, but I just, uh, I just realized how weak my shoulder is and how, how much harder I need to work on rebuilding it. How is everybody doing out there? Is everybody uh, talking about planting seeds because that's what most people are thinking about in January. <laughs> um, the thing is, the shoulder, uh, uh, Frida, I got only the first line of that before it went away. Unfortunately, with the cell phone, it only stays on there for just like three seconds. So um, all I read was when I was first skeet shooting. Christina, exactly. I was just talking to a friend about this. Uh, we have this uh, image. Well, this person suggested that we have this image of ourselves that is perpetually uh, 35 and that's the way I think of myself. And then I am, I pick up a heavy gun and I'm reminded that, boy, it's not, uh, 
you know, you have this image of be just being able to pick this gun up and do that, and it's heavy. <laughs> um, I don't know what I'm stepping in. Uh, if anybody had a question for me that I have missed because it went by so fast, put it up again. Uh, I can only read like about two lines of those uh, before they go away. And I don't know how to see them after they go away because I'm on the cell phone. Anyway, what else? Uh, yes, so uh, Jack Davis is, no, this was a, this is a 16, Gilbert. Walker, isn't that a 16? Walker? Are you both using a 16? No, he's using a 12. You're using 12. Yeah, 12 okay. Is the most common. I, I, mine's a rarer, rarer gun. Okay. Is yours lighter though, or is it the same weight? Mine's lighter than his. Ugh, oh, it's heavy. Ugh. Oh. You can try it if you like. No. It's probably a little bit easier on your shoulder. Say that again? punch but it's got more of a cushion on the end more of a punch i don't know i probably shouldn't <laughs> uh i had a hard time hanging on to that last one and i don't want to be unsafe i don't want to be unsafe for anyone's sake uh uh yeah daryl was just saying well yeah, see where I am, you can start sweet potatoes in a lot of different times of year, but uh, I guess in where most people are, you need to start sweet potatoes in January. I mean, start the start the slips in uh, the windowsill. Uh, how many people do we have? We have, I can't even see that. Uh, oh, 27. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, this is not about gardening, guys, uh, but this is where I am today. And, you know, because I'm in this, uh, thank you, Lori, hi. Uh, <laughs> uh, Frida, I had beginner's luck with garlic. I had beginner's luck with loofah. Oh, gosh, I had great luck with tomatoes before uh, mildew decided to move in and stay. Oh, Kevin, you missed it. <laughs> uh, I actually shot a shotgun a couple of times and um, I realized I'm not in any kind of shape to do that. I need to, I need to practice a shotgun where I can hold it onto something and then practice. Or is that a rifle? Yeah, rifles you can like lock onto a table. Yeah, so that's what Noel would have had for me, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I find that a whole lot easier. <laughs> Than, than balancing that thing, you know? Cause yeah. I mean, it takes a lot of strength to do that. Maybe I should practice with your bow first. What? Get my arm. That, that thing's strung to 70 pounds. There's zero chance you can pull that thing back. <laughs> have you ever done with a bow? Yeah, Shot with, I you have? have a bow myself. There's here. Yeah. Uh, did you get rid of it? No, no, did oh. you get rid of the bow? <laughs> yeah, I did. Yeah, I gave you... it to a family friend. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, Kevin, what did you just say? <laughs> Bad. Uh, what kind of bow do you have, Walker? Uh, Hoyt. Hoyt? Yeah. And it's strung to what, Other. 70 pounds? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> okay, guys, that's ridiculous. I am going to, I'm going to have to try it again. I didn't come all the way out here to shoot a gun two times. <sighs> no, I got to try it again. You want to see me try it again? Or you think maybe I've, I, that perpetual youth thing is really over with <laughs> and I better just hang it up oh gosh Lynn no 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 my right eye is dominant there's no way I could shoot off my left shoulder 
I don't even know how I don't even know how to do that. Uh, <laughs> wait, who said no? No, who said that? See what I my mistake was t doing it two times in a row. I thought I thought I'm going to do this three times in a row. Oh hush, Daryl. There's plenty of clay. Okay, be careful. I didn't get all of that. Uh. Teresa wants to see me do. Oh, Lynn can shoot from both. Wow, you must be strong. Just don't do it, Christina says. Yeah, I, um, ah, it's so hard to read. None of my, I, I missed the very last line of that. Can you, uh, if that was Gilbert, uh, you're a soldier, so <laughs> that makes it a little bit different. You had some training. Turn my iPhone. What, Frida? To see them shooting? Wait, what, Daryl? <laughs> I missed that. Gilbert, what what were you saying? I I this is ridiculous. It's so hard to do on the iPhone, guys. Little too old. It is a crossbow he has. I think I tried to It's a crossbow you have, right? No, it's not a crossbow. It's a, it's a compound bow. I'm sorry, a compound bow. That's what I meant to say. He has a compound bow. Oops, we still just have 27 people. <laughs> hey, Eric, you missed my big moment. E Gilbert, yeah, what a drag, huh? <sighs> well, the things we can do about arthritis from diet to, uh, well, mostly just the food we eat affects arthritis. Not a whole lot we can do about it otherwise. Each one of these seats is wet. <sighs> okay. Guys, do you want to see any more uh, <laughs> Thank you, Teresa. I was just going to say, do you guys want to see more more of this sort of thing? I do want to try it again. How many people want me to try it again? Somebody said no. <sighs> wow, that sounds interesting, Lynn. You must have good eyes. No, bungee jumping? I, absolutely not. I don't have the nerve for that. Hello from Russia. Kate wants me not to try it again. Nanu, hi, Ke hi, uh, Nanu. I'm at a shooting range in Austin, Texas with my son. Uh, he's shooting uh, clays with a friend. They are, you know, kind of beginners and, uh, but they're young and they're fit, unlike me. And, uh, but I was just, uh, you don't want my bones to snap <laughs> would it <laughs> oh <laughs> um i think the consensus is i better not try it again but i mean i only did one fairly decent oh wow 
I mean, I don't know how you can possibly hit that thing. Oh, I'm sorry. Just one more time, Lynn says. How many people want me to try it one more time? Hi. Hi. Anna wants me to try it one more time. Is this a hard one? This station? Yeah, this course is the hardest course they have here. Uh, why did we pick that? I mean, why does it matter? Yeah, because I'm not going to hit it anyway. <laughs> yeah. I just want to try it one more time. Try it now? Should I do it here? Or? I I wasn't okay, noticing so which way they so went. Shoot, then you can go. What? I wasn't sh watching which way they went. Well, it's fine. Watch now. Let me go and just. Watch. Okay. It is a 16, Gilbert. That's the one I'm shooting, but still it was hard to hang on to. It's heavy. And my shoulder is not what it used to be. Uh, Jeannie, Gina, sorry, Gina. We are at a shooting clay range in Austin, Texas and that's Walker firing right now. And he missed it. And um, he just joined this uh, range and bought these two shotguns from um, a friend of his up in uh, Minnesota. And so he's learning how to do it. He's always had very good eyesight, but this is, this is hard. Wow, I can't believe how hard... Yeah, I'll do it once. Okay. Whoa. Which, is that one going to come from the same way? You're going to hang on to this. Oh, wait, who's, who's going to... He's going to... You hold on to it. You got to... It's live, so... Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, which way is the, is it going to be the first one again? Remember, spread your feet more. Be ready for it. Your biggest thing for you is, yeah, don't, don't be yeah. That's fine, yeah. Okay. Or be ready for the recoil, don't, and don't put your finger on the finger, trigger until you're ready. Okay. The safety's yeah. off, so it's, re the, it's ready to fire once it's loaded. Okay. So pull it forward. So it's loaded. Okay, and which way is it going to come from? It's going to come from this one right here. It's going to it... come, come out. Here, I'll show you an example, okay? Yeah, okay. Don't, don't shoot. Don't shoot. All right, see? Okay. See? Yeah, that's what it's going to be. Okay. All right, whenever you're ready. Okay, pull. Oh, I missed it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh... You can put your finger now on the finger trigger when you're ready, but don't. Pull. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I guess. Success. I didn't get hurt. <laughs> uh, okay. That hurts the shoulder. Okay, I did it one more time, everybody. I didn't get hurt. It was exhilarating. Thank you. I didn't hit it, obviously, but it went in the direction of the clay. I was close in the direction of where it went. You don't want to shoot my... Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> There's no way. No, he already told me about that. And I said, no, I do not want to shoot 12. Anything heavier. I mean, my hand... Look. I think my hand is shaking just from that one time. So I guess I'm a pretty big wimp. I will, Daryl, when I have a garden, okay? Don't make me feel bad. 
<laughs> I, hello, Jamela from Trinidad and Tobago. I am in a shooting range in Austin, Texas. My son and his friend are uh, shooting clays today, and I gave it the old college try. And uh, uh, wow, just that one time, I feel it in my whole body. I wish I was stronger, I really do. Maybe I could get there, I don't know. <laughs> right. <laughs> I got in the direction. Hold on, watch this guy. Okay. Oh. So guys, feel free to leave whatever comments you want to each other. If you're leaving, if you're writing me a comment, make sure it's just like one sentence so I can read it before it goes away. Gina said, wait for the clay to hit the apex, then shoot, Walker. Uh, is, that, is that how it works? That's what someone recommended. Thank you, Lynn. With a sensible exercise. Yes, was Christina, obviously I'm not going to be doing this on a regular basis. Uh, okay, guys. Okay. Uh, uh, I don't have any magnesium to rub on my shoulder when I get home. I, uh, God, it's a good thing I didn't try to do this when I was getting over my broken shoulder. That would have been really stupid because it really, it really jerks the thing back. I thought it, I thought it would jerk. I thought it would push me here, but it pushes you right here. That's weird. Okay. Well, you know, live and learn. I'm just trying to, uh, I'm just trying to explain experience a few things guys because I have been <laughs> just kind of doing the same thing for a very long day yeah oh my god I went uh, oh I left home without it Daryl dang can't believe I did that uh yeah yeah well there's a bit of a problem with the hot water at <laughs> my son's new house he's in an HOA and they're uh he's struggling to try to get water pressure into their house and, and the the public water works are saying it's the HOA's fault and the HOA saying it's the public water's fault and it's like I I can't tell you how glad I am I do not live in an HOA ah uh, yeah well, I don't want a brutal gun, Gilbert, that's for sure. Anyway, um, what else? Let's see. Oh, you ready? Oh, yeah. Let's see. Put, uh, put Valentine's Day on your calendar. That's my birthday. I'm going to be 50 again. <laughs> uh, download those calendars, everybody, at uh, latebloomershow.com forward slash calendar dash planner and uh when we have the next live stream we're going to we're going to plan 2020 together uh, my friend lisa chandler has had mm -hmm. good morning has had a lot of great ideas about how to um, help me grow my uh interest in my myself and my channel and uh one of the things that she brought to my attention was this whole uh planner idea and uh and there's some big event in los angeles right now at i think it's at uh warner brothers well of course it would be at warner brothers uh they're having a big gilmore girls event and i did work on that show uh some time ago <laughs> And, uh, and I'm going to go over there and try to see if I can uh, take some pictures and, and see that they've, they've recreated all the sets and in this 
big area and they're going to have that set up until January 5th. So as soon as I get back, I'm going to try to go over. What would you guys, would, would you guys be interested in seeing uh, me do a live stream from, from that? Uh, uh, thank you. Would you be interested in seeing me do a live stream from the Gilmore Girls uh, recreated sets at Warner Brothers? Because I think I could uh, get in over there since I was on the show a couple of times. And uh, that would happen before January 5th. So I've got to get home and get that thing organized. But uh, I'm wondering if this is like a sense of adrenaline. Gilbert, is this adrenaline that I'm feeling? Uh, <laughs> okay, Rebecca. Uh, just like firing that gun like one time, it's like this whole, I, I feel like almost like the air got, you know how you feel when you, when you go into a higher elevation and you, it, you, you, you know, you kind of, I don't know, there's something really exhilarating about it, but, but I just wish I was stronger and better. Okay. Thank you, Jamila. Okay. Teresa. Great. Uh, Teresa, uh, let's see, Teresa, what was I going to tell you? Uh, you're two hours from Phoenix, right, Teresa? Thank you, Kate, everybody. Kate is uh, one of my moderators. I just got to meet her in person yesterday. If you didn't hear that, she drove up to meet me and she took me out for a catfish well, it was late lunch. There was nobody there. It was about 1.30 or 2 o'clock. And we had a big catfish meal at, a, at a, an original Austin restaurant called Catfish Parlor. Really funky old-time place with all kinds of old pictures on the wall. And, you know, big, big uh, kind, well, I wouldn't say family style. You know, they, but it, uh, I had black-eyed peas. I, I did the black-eyed peas just because I thought, well, I might and I get a chance to have black eyed peas before uh, New Year's Day, and uh, I doubt I'll be cooking any. So, uh, <laughs> uh, so yeah, so those are some of the things I'm going to be doing, and of course, as you know, uh, yeah, as you know, I am. Um, in transition, most I'm sure everybody that's tuned in knows I'm in transition in my life, and I'm, I'm, um, my house is for sale. There was a showing. See, today's Sunday. There was a showing on Friday, after I left. So I don't know how that went, but I uh, haven't heard anything. Someone moving, to, uh, trying to move to my neighborhood from the Cayman Islands. So see if anything happens there and uh, and I've got so I've got I'm planning my first video for my new apartment uh, which is I, I got sent a it's a uh, they used to make big ones I mean, they do make big ones of this this is smaller it's made in Sweden and it's a little what oh Watch, watch this disc coming out of here. This one will be fun to watch. Okay. Right here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Look, look. Oh, it just bounces on the ground. It's called a rabbit. Oh, okay. Is Doug there? Huh? <laughs> I, miss, I miss Doug tuning in because Walker was talking to me. Doug, I am at, in Austin City Clays. Wait, did you hit that? Yeah. Wow. Uh, I'm in Austin City Clays, and you missed uh, me sh shooting the gun, Doug. I tried it first. I tried it two times in a row, and by the second time, I was having a hard time holding the gun. It's too heavy, and it hit my shoulder, which, and I was reminded that I broke that shoulder two years ago. And uh, I did try it one more time, and I did get it. I did get the shot shot in the direction of the clay and didn't embarrass myself, but uh, that's it for me. <laughs> hey, Happy. <laughs> Hardly. 
Hardly. I think I'm going to stick to handguns. My, I feel that all in my whole shoulder. I feel that all in my shoulder. Uh, but Doug, if you're there, Walker had planned this outing with uh, with his friend Ray, and they, Walker is just getting into this. He bought two shotguns uh, when he was in Minnesota. He now lives in Austin, Texas. That's where I am. This place is called Austin City Clays, and it's on the edge of a wildlife preserve, so you're not supposed to shoot at any wildlife. Although, why any wildlife would be anywhere near all these gunshots, I don't know. There's plenty of ducks on the pond. <laughs> oh, really? The ducks on the pond? Oh, yeah. He said there are ducks on the pond. Hi, Michael. I've shot... Um, it's called seven lead and it's a 16 millimeter shotgun. Uh, I, Rebecca only saw half of that. Let's try the same one again, the first one. Yeah, yeah thanks, Kate. Uh, oh yeah, take a picture for me. Oh wow, you hit it. No, oh shoot, you guys. I didn't, I didn't hit it. Oh, you didn't hit it. There were two of them? No, that's the wad. There's, oh. a, there's a thing that you pack the, the gunpowder with in here that explodes out. Oh. It looks like sometimes you hit it, but you didn't. Oh, I see. Hey, you, you've surprised, I've surprised you before. <laughs> I, and you got it. Okay, is that Johnny? Johnny, are you there? I'm so mad at you. <laughs> Yesterday, I'm just going to embarrass myself further. <laughs> My son is cool. I'm so lucky. Um, Johnny Mazer, Mazer, Mazer. Oh, why do I always say it wrong? There's two... Johnny's and I get it I get the last name is so similar and I get it get it wrong but anyway yesterday I posted an Instagram after we had breakfast and I had <laughs> I had food in my teeth <laughs> there he is I had food in my teeth and he he said did you eat something white and I said what are you talking about there's food in your teeth I said oh my god <laughs> I can't believe you uh, pointed that out. Thanks so much. <laughs> I'm not perfect, okay? I am the first to admit that. I am not perfect. <laughs> That's real life. You've got it. <laughs> I'm going, <clears throat> whoops. <laughs> We're on the move again. <laughs> That's okay, Johnny. <laughs> oh, it's real life. It's real life. We are, we are real. I am real. <laughs> And if you were standing right beside me, you would know that. <laughs> right, Kate? Kate and I were together yesterday, and, and until yesterday, we're only human. That's I know, Gilbert. Uh, yesterday, uh, Kate and I got met for the first time, and, and we made our relationship real. You know, I mean, it's real. It's real, but when you meet somebody that you've, been connected to online, especially for a while. It's just, I don't know, it feels so natural. And uh, and it's uh, really cool. <laughs> yeah, we did. We did. We were going to bring you the Christmas tree. Uh, Austin has this amazing Christmas tree. It's very, I don't know, what did you say it was? A hundred? No. What did you, how, how tall did you say that thing was? 50 feet tall? I don't know. But it's made out of metal. It's a metal tower and it's just strings of lights. So in the daytime with the sunshine, you couldn't really see anything. And I was gonna try to do a live stream from there. Yes, I did, Michael. I'm sorry you missed it. You have to go back afterwards. I shot it twice. First, I shot it two times in a row and I could already feel that I called pull the second time before I was ready because the gun was heavy and I was feeling like I couldn't support it. And that was stupid. I should have just done it one time and handed the gun to Walker because 
I've never done that before, ever. And I broke this shoulder at the top, right at the top, two years ago. So, uh, you know, and that's right where it hits. So it's like, whew. I don't know what I was thinking to do it two times in a row. I thought I was going to do it like three times in a row, like bang, 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 you know? Mm, no, didn't happen. <laughs> and then, thank you, Kate. And then I rested for a while and I went back for one shot. And of course I missed it, but I got it in the, in the direction of the clay. Didn't embarrass myself. And so, anyway, uh, I, I can't believe how tiring that is. <laughs> I'd be in trouble if I went hunting. Yeah, this was a 16, so I was not, had no intention. He just offered for me to shoot his 12, and I said, no, that's okay. That's okay. I can live without that. But, uh, you know, when you have some upper body strength and you're young and muscular, it's different. Thank you, Kate. Uh, okay, what's everybody planting? What's going on? No, I... <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I think I'm done for today. Uh, what's everybody planting? What's everybody doing? I mean, it would be really great to go out having hit one, but I see they're missing, okay? And they've been practicing. So what's the chance I'm actually gonna hit one? I mean, it would just be luck. It would just be luck. Anyway, um, I think, uh, I think, let's see, gosh, this is 56 minutes. I thought this would be like 15 minutes. Uh, oh, okay, you guys are talking. Okay, good. Uh, what else? Okay, so if you came in late. Yes, uh, Kate's, Kate at Kate's Kitchen. Uh, I want to do an interview with her at some point. Maybe we'll do a Zoom interview once I figure out how, figure out how to do that because she's got... Uh, an interesting story. Oh, that's fa that's fantastic, Teresa. Uh, oh, cool. Let's see, where did I mail you those seeds? Oh. I mailed you those seeds. My brain is not working. That's fantastic, some, um, Amal. I only saw three comments came in at once and I saw one of them, I'm sorry. <laughs> So, uh, what's the plan, guys? I am going to be here in Texas uh, through Christmas. And uh, I have so much to do. It's overwhelming. And I'm trying not to just, I'm trying to just live in the moment and not, not uh, get overwhelmed by everything. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, hey, Ed. I did, I did, Ed. Ed, you'll have to go back and watch it. I did it. I shot three shots. Um, Uh, oh, Rebecca, that sounds wonderful. I have a lot of bok choy that I actually okay, planted the bok choy to, to put around to look nice for the sale of the house. And I wasn't really planning on eating it or anything. But I got all this. Um, I wonder who Rupert Marcel is. I just got some notifications from Twitter. Uh, he's liking all of my, who is Rupert Marcel Hux? Rupert Marcel Hux is liking, is following me on Twitter and is now liking all of my posts. I wonder if he's on live. If you are watching live, Rupert, please leave a comment. Uh, I saw that about your plant. Good morning, Kathleen. Oh my gosh, you missed it. Kathleen, uh, I shot the 16 gauge shotgun three shots that's it and uh, I can feel that my shoulder is sore just from that <laughs> so uh, 
amaryllis my amaryllis guys i thought i dug up all my amaryllis and i i didn't see i thought i, I thought i had four i thought i had three and i only dug up two and i didn't couldn't see the other one down there and i thought i'm taking my amaryllis with me that is flaming red and i'm taking everything red in my garden with me if i can and dug up two of them couldn't find the third one and then the day i the day i left or the day before i left i saw it was coming up and i thought oh gosh i hope eric i told eric to work on that section of the parkway and i hope he didn't dig that up and so i put a little a stand around it but uh it's just popping up it was just like a green leaf like that uh, out of the I'm ground, two double. two Let's leaves out of the goes. ground. So Let's it's going to be a while. Like I probably won't. I probably won't get oh, to see it bloom. I can. It's just like. What's up? Depending on what happens. Uh, really somebody said something like about my house sale, and I couldn't read the comment fast enough. Fast. No, Kathleen. I have never done it before, ever. So uh, right, cool. I I felt very to get it in the direction <laughs> of the clay and not <laughs> drop the gun. <laughs> um, gun is heavy and yeah, that's so I found it difficult to hold it like this. And I am, I know that I'm going to be sore just from shooting it, firing that weapon three times. Maybe like I do a year of practices in this, in this, I'll try the turn of the next year, like at the end of the year. <laughs> to see how bad I am compared yeah. to everyone else. Oh, gosh. I've never done okay, before. anybody else have any questions or anything they want to talk about? Should I stay on, oh, get like off? Trying. What do you, you guys seem to be enjoying each I'm other. We're on the move again. Uh, let me just pull out my planner again because, because, uh, some people got on late. Kathleen, you got on late. I want you to go to latebloomershow.com. Yeah, I tried to do that, Kathleen. I really did. But I'm not experienced. And it probably would be good to, you know, train for that somehow. <laughs> but anyway, I want to just pull this out real quick. Oh, come on. Hold on. I'll let you look at something while I do this. Uh, my calendar planners. Um, Happy, if that was for me, I did miss it. Guys, go to latebloomershow.com. You feel guilty for what? Don't feel guilty for anything. I don't even know what you would say that for. Uh... Go to my latebloomershow.com forward slash calendar dash planner and download my new, this is the black and white version of Jan January. I know most of you already already seen this, but some people tuned in late. Kathleen, you can see my beautiful January. That's These are photographs that I've taken of things in my garden that are appropriate to the month. Uh, this is a camellia, this is for January. I haven't filled any of this in yet, but you can go ahead and put for my schedule, because I want you to know where I am. I'm going to be in Nashville the 24th to the 29th. So uh, five nights I'm going to be in Nashville. Yes, it's, it's only January through March right now. I have April designed, but I had to do it this way for now because... What I want to do is I want to get this on Google Docs. I want to get the whole year on Google Docs, but I don't know how to do that yet. And I didn't have the, I didn't have the mental capacity <laughs> getting ready for a trip. I mean, it's so, when you're getting ready for a trip and your house is on the market and you've got a cat at home and you've got to make sure everything is thought of and cared for and taken care of, I just didn't have the mental capacity to learn something new and figure out how this uh, Google Docs thing wor works. So for right now, I have January, February, and March on my on a page on my website, and it's uh, 
If you don't get the link exactly, if you go to latebloomershow.com and you put in the search window, window calendar planner, it will come right up. Oh, thank you, Kate. <laughs> I could have asked for that. Uh, this is February. That's the black and white version. And what I did was in Photoshop, I turned these images into, well, I, uh, I had to experiment for a while because, you know, some of these vegetables don't have really strong uh, black and white lines, definitive lines. And, uh, and I wanted the black and white version to be something that you felt like it, it's, it still looked like it and that you could color it in. This is the cauliflower. This is one of the first cauliflowers I've ever grown. And this is one of my nasturtiums that was blooming in March. And uh, Celine, my uh, intern, has designed all of these months in, um, in Illustrator and uh, generated them into PDFs, which are downloadable, single page downloads from that link. And I want you all, oh, that's, wait, where's April? April is the cabbage. Where is it? <laughs> Where's my cabbage? I can't find my cabbage. It's here. I'm just, oh, there it is. Here's April. Ah, oh, come here. There's April. Isn't that pretty? So I just want to make it interesting for you, uh, visually interesting that each, each month has new graphics, new fonts and uh and a, a, a fresh feel for each month and we're going to download these and and fill them out together and you're going to know where i am and what my schedule is and uh you can look forward to me being in arizona again in the valley what they call the phoenix valley encompasses all of tempe uh uh oh goodness I'm just blanking. There's so many communities in the in the Phoenix Valley, and uh, I will be there March the sixth to the 9th. So that weekend, I will be visiting Jack Davis in Epic Yard Farm 2.0, and we're going to see the progress that she's made. She tripled or quadrupled or I don't know five. It's, it's five times the space that she had in her other garden. Uh, so uh, that that's coming up and then of course hopefully the Gilmore Girls event I, I hope hopefully I can do a live stream from the set of the recreated sets of the original Gilmore Girls before the 5th of January and uh, when they close that exhibit and uh, I know there are lots of Gilmore Girls fans around the world. It's a huge uh, group that love that show. And I did work on that show a couple times. So, wow, my hand is going numb. What is going on? <laughs> oh gosh, why can't we just stay young longer? Darn it. Ah, something's gotta give here. Ah, I gotta take this hand thing off. Let, let you guys watch them shoot for a little bit longer. Not easy, is it? No, he did really well at this stage. What did you say, Kate? Fantastic, Lori. 
Okay, have you got those dates marked out? Ray, can you pull that thing off my thumb? Yeah. It's just like, ah, I should have had you undo the thing. Okay, thank you. Uh, Okay. Yeah. Let's see. There you go. <laughs> no, no, not quite that long, Kate. But uh, now I got my what I would like is, I would like, if I if I could say what I like, I would like thirty more good years of being like really fit and able to do a lot of stuff and experience all the all the there stuff I didn't get to do yet <laughs> that I would like to do. So, don't want to jump out of an airplane that's really not on my list uh let's see uh shoot i missed that okay this is muddy all right guys uh listen you have a wonderful day i'm gonna sign off i i, I hope this has been enjoyable um, unless you think i should try it one more time I'm going to sign off. So let me know if you want me to try it one more time. I think I've rested enough that I could try it one more time. It's not going to be any better than the last time. It can't be, you know. But uh, should I try it one more time? Let's see what you say. Okay, everybody's gone. Okay. <laughs> okay. I think you're right, Lynn. Okay, I, guys, I'm going to sign off. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to share this channel, and and I really appreciate all I really appreciate all your support. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't think so, Christina. Good point. Hey, thanks for. Uh, yeah, uh, the shoulder pad. Yeah, I have a lot. I have actually some padding in this jacket, and. Uh, now that I've done it once, I know kind of it needs to be more over here rather than over here. Uh, anyway, if I do it again, I will. I wanted to get a jacket. I wanted to get a vest for shooting. And I thought, you know, I'm going to do this once maybe. I don't know if I'll get a chance to do it again. Who knows? So uh, I didn't want to buy, you know, stuff that was for shooting if I'm not even going to be here shooting. <laughs> So anyway, thanks so much, everybody. Um, thanks for being a part of this live stream. And uh, I love you guys, all, all, all of you. And, and take care of yourself. Have a wonderful holiday. And I will say that, uh, where will I be next Sunday? I'll have a live stream. I just don't know exactly where I'm going to be. So be sure and tune in. I may have another live stream. The thing is, I didn't have time to edit more videos before I left. So I don't have any uploads coming, so I may be doing another live stream this week somewhere. Maybe on Christmas. Uh, yeah, maybe on Christmas. So anyway, love you, Frida. I miss you. I want to see you so bad. Okay, so everybody, uh, if you missed the, vid the last video I did with Daryl, I wish you'd watch it, please. Uh, that didn't get nearly enough video uh, views and I I am really proud of that video I think it's uh, it has a great mood and and you really see what a beautiful place he has and um, he's got it he's really got it going on over there and and I really hope you'll you'll scroll back in my videos and watch that video with Daryl and any of the other videos that haven't gotten a lot of views like the, the waffle my waffle video <laughs> Oh, anyway, thanks so much, guys. I uh, I really appreciate your support. Love you, and um, happy holidays, and I'll talk to you soon.